All right, all right. Thank you very much. So, I mean, um, if, for example, if your kid wants to go into acting, what will be the advice for, 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 for that person? Well, I mean, we, we, I, I, definitely I won't stop him. You know, I'm, I'm definitely I would, um, more, I would do more of guidance, you know, guiding him, especially having gone through my journey. Um, you know, from hindsight, I can tell him that, look, these are the mistakes that I did. Um, and so avoid these ones and so that you can, you know, things will move faster for you and, and you can have um, advantages, take advantages of opportunities that I w was mm -hmm. not able to take advantage mm -hmm. of so that um, you would be a better um, um, all-rounded um, act act actor than I, than I am or I All would right. ever be. All right. Yeah. Thank you. So um, there's Thompson Lodson saying that, um, yeah, that's my lecturer. Uh, are you a lecturer? Yeah, I'm a part-time lecturer in Nafti. <laughs> oh, bow wow. Oh, okay. All right. I, oh, fine. Oh, good, good, good. All right. So, um, so, I, <laughs> so how, how did, um, from now, like, from now, what, from now to next year, what are some right. of the things you would like to see in the, in the industry, in the movie industry, or in your yeah. life? Right. I, th I think that more importantly, you know, we're, we're living in times where, you know, at least this pandemic has taught us that um, life can be very unpredictable. Mm. Um, I know, we know death is inevitable, yes, but, you know, um, things like viruses, yes, you know, can also just catch us unawares. Of course. And I think that for an industry that thrives on, you know, that togetherness coming together and even in the u.s i know that it's hampered production you know okay. so uh, we're not we're not in this alone um but of course what i would want to see is us looking into the future and and sort of um, projecting into the future that times like this may, may be with us now i mean corona has taught us that look it could it, it might even stay with us who knows and or maybe there could be something else and so um, let's prepare towards the future. How do we um, still engage our audiences and, and give them, you know, the best of, of us, even in the absence of, of premieres, of, of, uh, of, of cinema? Um, um, how do we engage the online um, platform so that we, we still keep that, that, that bond going and, and still give them the quality that they deserve? And so uh, we may have to go into the technical areas um, of, of, of engaging um, um, our audience, um, you know, and even in our production, how, how are we uh, going to tailor our production so that we are we're in a safe environment that we're, we're, we're trying as much as possible to keep our social distance and still make good movies. So these are the conversations that we need to begin to have in order that um, we'll, we'll be prepared that when something like this happens, we'll, we'll not be handicapped, you know, because um, this caught us unawares and, and we're, we're really struggling, you know, um, trying so hard to, to, to find ways in which we can um, send, you know, do work and then, and then make some income. So, yeah. I spoke to Kofia Samoa the last time, I think last week, right. and there are certain right. there are certain things that we talked about. I would like to bring those uh, those stuff as mm -hmm. well to see what you think of right. those as as we as we move on. All right, and also with the Corona, since you touched on Corona, um, do you think that mm -hmm. um, this can help the industry positively, or is degrading the whole the whole development of the industry? I mean, look, it, it depends on how we embrace it. You know, if, if we see it as a destroyer and, and therefore, you know, we're, we're so um, pessimistic, I mean, it, it would definitely drown us already. We have challenges already. I mean, foundational, structural challenges. And so we need to see it as probably maybe a blessing in disguise. I think that um, in, with everything that we're, we're faced with as, as a human race, we find ways in which we triumph over. And so uh, we need to em embrace it and say, look, let's even assume that Corona is here to stay. I mm -hmm. mean, we hope mm -hmm. that it, that's not the case, but yeah. if, if we want to assume that it is, well, how do we, you know, sort of live with Corona, you know, um, and, and therefore thrive? And, and so I think that, Yes, we can fully act take advantage of this fully. And, and, and mind you, you know, today where everybody is, is online, you know, but just by the click of a button, I think that our audiences, we can get even our numbers even there. Um, there are people who would rather stay home and not go to a cinema uh, because of proximity, um, you know, and et cetera, because we have less cinema houses. People are thinking, oh, I have to take a um, car or trotro all the way. And when they close, challenges of transportation, mm -hmm. especially when they 
they don't have a car. So the, 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 the percentage of, of our audience who cannot, you know, go to the cinema. And therefore, these are people who are in the home um, setting. And therefore, how do we reach out to these people 